Schadenfreude. Schadenfreude. The reason I bring up this word is evangelical Christian leader Ted Haggard, who is currently in the news because he was accused of having sex with a, a male prostitute and buying drugs from him. Since then, he has admitted to A, buying the drugs but flushing them, and B, getting a massage from a male prostitute, which seems terribly suspicious, especially since his credibility is already <clears throat> gone. And, uh, I, I, I'm torn on this. On the one hand, I want to make jokes. Lots and lots of jokes. Oh my god. When I hang out with evangelical Christians, they tend to make jokes about the sex scandal Bill Clinton had back in the late 90s, which was like, I don't know, 10 years ago now. And so now that one of their own is embroiled in, let's face it, a much worse scandal, I really, I really have little pity for the guy based on my experiences with others. And the other thing is that evangelical Christians want strange things done to our country in the name of politics, like <coughs> excuse me, like um, putting people in prison if they say something offensive on the radio slash TV. And, uh, you know, that's just a start. This is a group of people where you'll get quotes like, I don't see why we fight Iraq. Why don't we just bomb the shit out of them and for make it a glass parking lot? Let's nuke the fuckers. You know? Well, they don't say nuke the fuckers. They say, I, th I think we should, you know, employ nukes against them. And, uh, other great bits of wisdom. And, uh, just... Now that one of their own is being lampooned in the media for not being able to live up to their own hyper strict world view, it feels good to poke fun at them. But on the other hand, on the other hand, I, uh, yeah, you gotta feel for the guy. Even though his world was probably based on lies and deceptions throughout his life. He had a life, and uh, he had a family, had kids, and now that's all being taken away, probably. His job, probably, <laughs> I, I would say his job's probably flushed, and uh, I don't know, maybe, depends on the group, maybe his wife will divorce him, maybe not, kids will probably get taken away, his status is gone, his credibility is shot. Honestly, he's got to be contemplating suicide right now. I'd put money on it. And uh, I just, I feel bad for the guy. I really do. And I, I just don't know. Lampoon him? Not that, not that anybody will ever hear me, not that anybody will really care. But just for society in general, make fun of him? Mocking the way that evangelical Christians would like to turn the world into an unlivable situation? A situation that even their best can't live up to or be humane look at what the guy's having to deal with now I don't know tough call catch you guys later bye